Count Tolstoy, in his book, ah. he quotes you as saying, uh, even now the full story has never come out. Uh, of course it hasn't. What is the full story? Do you know the full story? Full story? Handing over. Handing over, giving them back to Russia. And to the Yugoslavs also? Hmm? And also to the Yugoslavs? Precisely. Quite correct. By what you mean? You mean by that? Uh, that I mean by handing over to an ally, women, children, and people. No more, no less. What was your feelings at the time about that? Knowing that these men, women, and children would be killed. Not my orders. Not my order. You had just received your orders and that was it then? That is exactly it. The fail is the fail. Orders are orders. I have no feeling whatever. What was the general attitude towards the Croatians? How did you consider them? <sighs> Foreign people. But did you hear the machine guns? Yes. On the Yugoslav side of the border. Oh, for Christ's sake. Using guy like this, talk about fucking kids being shot down. He hadn't got any time for people in his way. The bastard slaughtered. What was the conversation between the, uh, between the ordinary British soldier about this whole business? Dirty. They didn't like doing it. No. A dirty business, in which we did not wish to be mixed up. A dirty, bloody political business, in which we did not want to be. Were you given a reason at all, or just given the orders as a, as a low-level soldier? We were ashamed of it. Did, did your superiors ever give you a reason for the, for the repatriations of these people? Or did they just... We were ashamed. We still are. Okay, well, thanks very much for uh, allowing me to interview and uh, I really do appreciate it. We're ashamed of it. Okay, thank you. We're ashamed of one thing. And we haven't got the guts to say fuck off. Yeah. Well. Jesus Christ.